Today, we are going to talk about one of the most remote, cold, and undisturbed areas on the earth. Can you imagine a place where the sun never sets or never rises? That is right, 24 hours of sunlight and 24 hours of darkness. This is not a place of fantasy or fiction. It really exists. It is called the Arctic Circle. Every year in June, during the summer solstice, the sun never drops below the horizon. On the other hand, in December, during the winter solstice, the sun is not seen for an entire 24-hour period. The Arctic Circle, despite its long days and long nights, is actually home to about 4 million people including the famous indigenous people called the Inuits. In fact, eight countries have land within the Arctic Circle. Alaska, United States, parts of Canada, Russia, Norway, Finland, Sweden, and Greenland, owned by Denmark, all occupy a part of the Arctic Circle. The Arctic Circle is also home to a diverse wildlife population. There are grazing animals that live there, like the reindeer. Yes, they are real, even though they are more famous for pulling Santa's sleigh. Moose, oxen, and sheep. You will also find predators like the wolf, wolverine, fox, and of course, the polar bear. The waters in the Arctic Circle are teeming with a wide variety of fish, seals, walrus, sharks, whales, and one really weird species called the narwhal. The narwhal is sometimes called the unicorn fish because it has a three meter long tusk sticking straight out of its head. But perhaps the strangest of all natural events that occurs in the Arctic Circle is the Northern Lights. The Northern Lights is an incredible display of purple, green, yellow, and soft pink colors that dance across the entire sky at night. It is one of the most stunning natural phenomena found anywhere on planet Earth. And finally, here is an interesting fact about the Arctic Circle. It is home to the Global Seed Vault. The Global Seed Vault is a storage facility built deep into the Arctic permafrost that stores more than 4,000 plant seeds needed to grow food and sustain life in the event of a natural or man-made disaster. I am Gary Vernier, and this has been a Pascual Bravo English Project documentary. Until next week, good luck with English.